So as you see, we returned back to uh, this area near the, the fire crystals or the fire dungeon. The reason for that is because I stopped by to get more supplies, more potions, and to stay at the inn. Also, it's a good guide to where we're going to be going next. And that is pretty much just north. There should be a, uh, a place where we can dock the ship. Well, it's a pair, but we actually don't need to dock the ship, we can just go straight from here. We're gonna kind of go through this maze of the water to lead where, we're, uh, where we want to go. And you can look at the mini map and easily kind of see where we need to go. Well, not really easily, I guess it's just help follow. Which is nice because they don't like the original game had this. The PSP might have, I think it did, but you had to do like a certain button combination to like view it. It was very weird. But no, this version just seems to just add it. All times you can see the map. Which is very helpful. See, this is where we want to go. We can just do the ice, the cavern of ice. And here we can find more monsters. I probably don't need to be actually using magic for, this, for these uh for these monsters. They're pretty weak. Oh god! I hate these things. I don't know if fire fire might be better. I guess those things aren't much of a threat as I thought they would have been. Okay, they weren't actually much of a threat. Uh, they even add the, add the mini map to the, uh, the, uh, Dungeon as well, which is really nice. Because because uh, they even added a main map to the dungeon, which is nice. Because well, I, I don't think even the PSP version you had a map for the overworld, but not the. Um, Not the uh, dungeons. At least I don't remember the venue map in a dungeon. I do appreciate these two story masters. The uh, screams that. Very good uh, adaptations of the original. The original, original. These to consoles, that would be nice. Well, if it is, I would much prefer like a collection 
I don't know if I would want to pay them, pay for all of them individually. I paid for. I guess I, I paid for this one individually, but that's just most likely a one-time thing. Don't know if I'll get the others. Yep, there goes the monk. Uh, let's see. Did buy Phoenix. Did buy some. Bought a lot of high potions. I don't, I'm not sure if these games are even ported to consoles, at least they're not at the time I'm recording this. Uh, I think they're just mobile and the Steam exclusive. Which I guess is not bad. If they wanted to port these to consoles, I could. It would definitely, I think, would still be considered uh, purchasing. Oh, I could have gotten the other one. Yeah. Ooh. I didn't buy the upgrade deal, did I? No. I didn't think I'd need it. Stop. Stop that. Nope, there. Oh, well, he's still the Black Mage is still alive. Uh, no, he's not. Hopefully the monk will most likely finish this one and probably will finish the other one next round. Next round. Oh well, well the black mage guy's revenge. It might be weaker, but I think it does do more damage to. Uh, I. Uh, uh, like ice. Uh, monsters. Because there are elements and, like, weaknesses in this. In this game, I just don't think the game tells you that there are. Um, I know the ice sword definitely has, I think, popped as more damage than fire enemies, which would have been helpful in uh, you know, a dungeon of fire. Uh, I think you could technically do this for the, like, do this dungeon before. I uh, like the fire. Of uh, the, yeah, the volcano cavern, and do the fire crystal uh, but I'm not entirely sure yep. ice, ice armor more evasion oh, yeah. what was the other thing uh, nothing uh, they seem to be equipped. It was. 
Miss more clubs. Uh, where to go this way? There's nothing here. I wanna see if these do do more damage. Uh, probably not. I don't think so. I think he was doing that much damage with the ice sword. I don't think there's a boss in this area. I don't remember there being one. There might have been. Maybe the fire sword will be useful against that. Uh, this area just looks like a dead end, but there might be a chest. I'll just run from these. Yeah, dead end. Just try to speed this up. Uh, oh, something down here. Aren't that strong? Yeah. Oh my. Ooh. Ah. Oh. Yeah, there's definitely uh, weaknesses, I just don't know what weaknesses are what. Like, obviously the undead are weak to the white magic, like the Dia spells. In fact, they're the only undead monsters, like, there's like, monster types, there. Which are like the zombies, the spectrals, specters, the ghouls, uh, like the mummies, are all considered the undead. And definitely, like, yeah, white magic does affect them. It affects only them, because non. Uh, I know that non undead monsters will take zero damage from uh, those types of spells. Seem like these have a fire sword, it has a fire element, these ice monsters would be weak to it. But uh, I don't really see it. Seems to be doing average damage. Right there. Right, these things are actually special. A lot of gale. Okay. Uh, if you can't come here before the uh, doing the fire dungeon, the volcano, then uh, yeah, that's a good idea to come here. You could probably level up a little bit, and you can definitely get some. Uh, a lot of gil to buy a bunch of uh, armor spells. It's a good equipment. Yeah, uh, you can probably get the um, that fire, which actually, if there are elements, it's probably not going to help you. Uh, the ice brand is probably more likely going to help you in that area. Sleeping bag. Ice shield. No. Equipment. Good. Uh, what else did I get? I think it was just items. Other items. 
Uh, you can step on that crack, and I think that's what we're supposed to do, but I see... Uh, stairs. Stairs. And I want to check that out first. Because I do believe going, stepping on that crack and falling down is where you're meant to be going. Oh, whoops. Nope. That just takes us all the way out for some reason. Well, guess I'll just cut back to my area where we're supposed to be. Alright, so now that actually I can come back here. I can actually get this, which is just monsters. Right. I know it's a really powerful spell that does not actually do that much damage. I just was. Oh. Well, the monk and white mage might die. They are. Hope that kills him. Okay. If not, then I might have been screwed. Oh. Did all that. Thanks, game. I gotta fight this thing again. Alright, so now that we're back, we can actually step on a crack and fall through. And this will bring us back to that chest with monsters that has nothing but clues in it. But eh, it does give us access to this. There is a boss fight in here. Uh, I don't know if this thing's undead, probably. I'll just throw, just throw magic at it. Oh, I guess I didn't need to. Tame the Levy Stone. No. Well, too. Fight this thing again. So, now that we got that, our goal is to leave the, this uh, area, uh, the Cavern of Ice. And we do that by, of course, going through the steps of stairs that I took the first time. If I remember this thing better, uh, better if I had a better memory of this dungeon. I would have known to get the thing first, realizing that I would have had to come back here to take the stairs instead of taking the stairs first. And it resulted of me doing this cavern three times, going through this cavern three times. Well, I guess it's only like two and a half. This way.